Remodeling construction at the Collier Area Transit, or CAT, Maintenance and Transfer Facility on Radio Road is nearing completion of Phase 1. Public Transit and Neighborhood Enhancement Division Director Michelle Arnold details the Phase 1 improvements. First phase included um, a building what we're standing on right here is our sawtooth bays and what that is is where the buses will pull in and they're, it's built at a perfect angle for them to pull in, not have to reverse. They pull in and they easily get out and then we actually um, added a second uh, exit. So we're going to have a flow in one way. They come in, they park, they load and unload uh, passengers and then they take off and, and leave the facility to go on their um, uh, continued route. Um, in addition to that, we uh, had uh, bathrooms built for the public. And uh, before, if you guys were here, we had porta johns that the public were using. So uh, the public has their own restrooms now, which is great. We made the facilities ADA compliant. Uh, in the rear, which we're excited about, is we have our own fueling island. That was a part of the construction. Uh, we had previously, or we actually continued to fuel our buses um, by a fueling truck. Um, that was something that, you know, time consuming. Uh, we have now four different locations where buses can pull in, fuel, park, and uh, so we're excited about that. Phase two of the project will include canopies for the Sawtooth Islands and a bus wash. The entire project, which was completely paid for with grant money, will be completed next year.